Motor Week is made possible by rockauto.com. In the past few years, we've noticed a lot of changes in new car paint, especially in American cars, believe it or not. They have smoother textures, better shine, and just look better in general. Lisa Barrow in her FYI report finds out just what's beneath today's new car shine. The glossy reflection that you see in the paint in this new car is not due to a good wash and wax, but rather to millions of manufacturers' dollars spent on research and development. Those dollars helped develop something called base coat clear coat paint. In the early 70s, American manufacturers had to begin using paint products that were less harmful to the workers and the environment. The resulting finishes weren't as shiny or durable as the ones used on some import cars. So, to keep up with competition and still meet with EPA requirements, American manufacturers developed base coat clear coat paints, the type of paint that produced the shiny finishes on many of those import cars. Base coat clear coat, which is basically the same metallic structure, metallic flakes that give you metallic effect and um, color, and then it required a clear coat for the gloss and durability. Paint finishes start in the research lab such as General Motors Coatings Laboratory in Warren, Michigan. That's what this building is for, is to understand why paints work the way they do, why equipment works the way it does. But there's more to a shine than just the paint and equipment. It starts with the metal quality and also in the paint application. We're uh, using automated equipment and the latest uh, electronic control devices the vehicle goes through a series of primer dips. Then the base coat is applied, followed by the clear coat. Base coat clear coat paint systems are safer for auto workers, and the paints themselves have many advantages over older lacquer and enamel paints. But is there a dull spot in the finish? When it comes to repair, base coat clear coat paint will cost more, generally about one third more than standard lacquer or enamel finishes. Here's why. We have uh, put this booth in, which is the latest technology downdraft spray booth, which has its own uh, water filtration system, which will take the pollutants out of the air before they are introduced into the uh, environment. This shop's investment was about $54,000. The painter must wear a complete bodysuit with a separate breathing system supplied with outside air. Most body shops must also invest in a mixing machine. And it's designed for a car repairman, a, a car painter, to come in and go to a microfilm viewer and look up the formula for a particular color and then takes the desired colors, mixes them together and makes the color for the particular car. A new paint process called Three Stage is already on the market and will likely replace base coat clear coat in the future. A three Stage is a process using a transparent mica which is sprayed on top of a light foundation coat. The mica has no protection in itself, so the third and final stage is a clear coat. They're going to be very clean, desirable colors, uh, very, very bright and brilliant. They're, they're going to change colors in different light sources. Paint development is an ongoing process. Manufacturers are constantly researching and developing new paint. The results will cost a little more in the long run, but they'll bring the brightest shine to new car finishes.